26 firefighters from South America are in northern Nevada this week, getting some advanced training from local firefighters. It's part of a partnership with Truckee Meadows Community College and a company called Free Spirit USA. Chris Buckley shows us what they're learning. It's our own little Disneyland. Here. Carson City's Regional Fire Training Center welcomed more than two dozen firefighters from Chile this week for some advanced training. We've been doing everything from fire command to fire control, a little bit of wildland fire command. Uh, they're going to do a whole day of auto extrication using tools and techniques that we use here in the states. All of the firefighters in Chile are volunteers, which makes it crucial for this type of training and for these commanders to take that knowledge back to their crews. These are all department leaders from the Santiago region. They cover about 7 million people. So the impact of what we're teaching them here this week, we think it's going to be tremendous when they go back and start putting it into everything, you know, into work in their own departments. And it's not just about the skills and techniques. They'll also go on calls with local departments. The hope is to build cohesiveness and leadership and bring that knowledge to the 15,000 firefighters under their command. They're eating the same place, they're, they're running, they're sweating, they're, they're doing what they don't do. But they'll be able to bring some of that experience of the sharing part, learning uh, how to behave better somehow and pass it to their people. This is the first time TMCC has done something like this. The firefighters from Nevada, Carson City and the other jurisdictions that are supporting this program this week, phenomenal firefighters, excellent instructors and to have the opportunity to teach the firefighters from Chile is fantastic. And it's a program they hope to continue. A lot about what the professionalism of the job is all about and sharing information with each other, learning from each other and the camaraderie. Covering the story in Carson City, Chris Buckley, 2 News.